What's going on everybody? So today we are back with another video about the home and honestly, I thought I was kind of done with talking about the home. I didn't think it was a crazy, crazy big deal, even though I was really upset about the fact that all the monsters respawn at these random times based on when you kill them. But, well, let me just show you here. I was doing my building loan here. Oh, it looks like I'm in a team still. But this morning I decided to go ahead and start uh, clearing my building because I ended up clearing it really late at night um, three days ago. And I didn't want to stay up all night doing it. So I decided to go ahead and, oh, you know what, I'll do it in the morning. So I start out this morning and I was trying to clear it quickly because the update was coming. I knew it was coming, um, but I just, I didn't have enough time to clear it. And then boom, I got stuck halfway through my kill, uh, killing process and it messed up my farm so much. Uh, and it's just something that I think is so, so weird that they absolutely need to change. This is something that's affecting a lot of you. I can't tell you how many comments I got on the video talking about how the uh, the monsters, you know, kind of changed or the respawn kind of changed based on the translation issue. Technically, it didn't change at all. It was just a translation issue. But regardless of whether or not it actually changed, it changed in the perspective of people's eyes because, uh, well, it did, it's not the same as what we expected because that's what it said in the translation and it's no longer the case. So you can see here, I've cleared out a bunch of these areas over here and I managed to get through all of, around this area here. And then I uh, took like a five minute break here cause I <laughs> went to go to the bathroom and I came back and I got disconnected and I could not finish off the last half of the map here which is just so irritating. And the main reason this is irritating is because I couldn't do it as soon as the update was done. And therefore I had to come back a couple hours later. So now my monster respawns are like 72 hours from that time, which was like six hours ago or so. And now the other half of the map is six hours different from my first half of the map. But I'm sure a lot of you out there are experiencing the exact same thing I am in this situation, which is so, so unfortunate um, because of how annoying it is. Um, now, granted, this won't really uh, stop the um, kind of a progress for my buildings because the boss monsters is really what gate keeps your progression for your buildings. However, this does basically put a ramp into my shop buying capability this couple, next couple of weeks, which is really, really unfortunate because I wanted to purchase a couple of weekly things and I thought that, hey, this is one of the bonuses for this. However, with all the updates, with all the real life stuff going on, I'm sure many of you, like I do a lot of the gaming full time here. Um, so I have a lot more time uh, for me to do this in my regular schedule. But a lot of you out there, including a lot of people in my comment section, really really hate this feature and honestly i have no idea why uh this is even implemented and i want to talk about something else here that goes along with this and that is we are on the basically or riding the trail of the chinese server and i absolutely hate it um and really this is the first time i've kind of noticed this but a lot of people were saying oh the chinese server started out this way the way we have it right now the reason why it was a translation issue was because the Chinese server then later on changed to that Monday reset. When it translated over to the global version, they had that uh, post update version in this um, kind of information menu, when in reality it was the pre update version in the Chinese server. Basically what I'm saying is the Chinese server has gone through all these problems. They've received the feedback and they've made the changes. But because we are several months behind the Chinese server, we're forced in what Hoda is doing here to go through the exact same process that the Chinese server is. I hate it. The only changes that they're making realistically, <clears throat> from what I've understood, is the actual stats of the characters, which mind you, and the banners and things like that. Th the game is a lot different. No, no, no doubt about that. But what's weird about it is there's all these quality of life things that the Chinese server has already. Like people like these features, but for some reason they downgrade us. And then they, a lot of people are saying, well, we just have to wait for 2.0 to get this update because that's when they dropped it for Chinese server. Why can't it just happen now? I, I just don't get it. Um, and honestly, this is starting to, uh, this particular one really drove me over the edge to make a video about it today. Because again, I thought I was kind of done. I thought I was just 
you know, relaxing. And as we're talking here, I'm going to go kill these bears because me as well. I'm not going to kill the other uh, elites yet. I'm going to wait for the whole thing to reset, as I'm sure many of you out there are going to do as well. I want to clear it all at the same time. I usually set aside, you know, 45 minutes to go ahead and just go through and clear everything. And it's just irritating when I have to do it two separate times. Um, so I'm just going to wait. Uh, and that's what I, that's what's going to happen now. I just don't understand why this can't be a Monday reset. It, to me, it's a very simple change. You can keep the monster respawn every 72 hours if you want and keep the bosses spawning at Monday, I guess, if you really want. I just don't understand why, if you wanted to do the 72 hour thing for the random monsters around the world, give it set times. You know, let's say Monday at, uh, what is it, 5 a.m., at least on the information menu, reset everything. And then again on Thursday or Friday, reset all the monsters, uh, the elite monsters. Do it at set times. It makes it so much easier for everyone out there to do whatever they want, whenever they want it, without making them feel like they're falling behind. Now, there's a few things that I want to talk about in terms of counter arguments, if you could even say that, or people just uh, mad that people are complaining about this. For one, um, a lot of players do want to keep up with the game. And one of the biggest ways to keep up with the game is to get matrix uh, matrices and get extra power and all that type of stuff. And the home is one of the best ways to go ahead and get those late game matrices. However, in order to progress your home, you do need to keep up with this type of killing the, all the monsters in this area. Now, if you have it to where it's gonna stall everyone out a day or two or hours every single time it spawns, well, then it starts to scale and scale and scale every single time this happens. And then you have people literally weeks behind by the end and people are then weeks behind on some of their matrix progression or potentially some other issues. I'm not saying this is gonna be 100% what happens, but I'm saying that this is potentially what could happen with this. And then a lot of people are saying, I don't know why people are upset. It's just a game, just play how you want. I guess that's the whole issue is that we are forced, if we wish to keep up with the game, which is what we want to do, we are forced then to play at the specific times that we didn't even prepare for. That's the other thing about this is that we didn't know that this was going to be the case. A lot of us, including myself, thought it was going to reset on Monday, and I didn't want to stay up super late that first day when it ended up coming out, so I cleared it this following day, which means I'm already a day behind everyone else out there that ended up staying up that night, which is really irritating because now not only that, but I also have to wait for another um, couple of days whenever I killed. I don't even remember when I killed it in the day. I can't plan for any of this. Like there was no option to plan for it because they made a mistake. Fine. I'm not going to you know bash them for making a mistake that it, it is what it is. But then they go and can't correct the quality of life that a lot of us are asking for. Granted, it's only been a couple days. So, you know, I'm not going to not going to say that they're not going to correct it because, again, it only has been a couple of days. But I think this is a very simple thing. It's a very, very simple fix. And it would make a lot of players happy, especially the players um, for one, like myself, I like to plan out some of the content that they're doing, like content creators and things like that or for the casual players especially, um, or even for the more hardcore players that have other things to do with in their daily life. Um, you know, hardcore players, they enjoy being hardcore and pushing for all min and max stuff. They also have real lives as well. And, you know, if they're having a tr trouble min maxing because their spawns are so auto all over the place and they may miss an hour here, an hour there, or maybe um, some a random issue somewhere, they might have to wait a day. That's irritating for them as well, regardless of if they enjoy pushing the game to the max, they will always be downsided by this specific change because not only may they have something that comes up into their daily life, but also it takes time to kill the monsters. You know, that last monster that you kill, let's just give you a, a generous estimate here, or an average estimate, maybe about 30 to 45 minutes to kill the whole packs. Well, guess what? If it resets on Monday, well, that wouldn't be the case because you wouldn't have to wait 30 or 45 minutes extra for everything to get killed. But now you do because of the way all the monster spawns and everything works. If you decide to go ahead and clear a little bit faster or anything like that, again, that's a minor gripe. But the whole point is that the previous situation was something that we could allow ourselves to control our schedule a little bit more. And this now new translation fix basically alerts us to the fact that we are forced, if we wish to keep up and mid-max here, 
to play whenever we kill the monsters and give us less freedom. I don't know if I'm complaining about this. Um, I, I think it's a reasonable thing to complain about, especially based on how much comments I got about this. And I wanted to address it because I think it's an easy fix. Maybe I'm just a little silly and this is something that doesn't bother you all as much as I thought it did based on the comment section. Let me know what you think in the comments uh, section down below because I don't know, this is just, it seems like such an easy fix to me and it, it, it's a huge, huge quality of life detriment right now because of how irritating the whole process is. As I said, I got interrupted in the middle of my farming session because of an update and I know that's gonna stall my monster spawns by six hours now because I couldn't come back to it. So now it all, it messed up my whole couple next resets. So that is irritating to me and that's what pushed me to make this video. Let me know if you all have a similar scenario, maybe some real life, something came up and now you've kind of messed up your spawn rates yourself. I really just wish they would go back to what they initially proposed on their translation initially. I, I just don't see. I don't know. I'm rambling now, but thank you all for watching. If you did watch up to this part, be sure to sub and like the video. And I do want to hear your thoughts down below if I am uh, pushing for this a little too hard. Again, I just am making videos here um, talking about some of the things that you all have brought up in the comment section, as well as some other things in the game. So that's really what we're here for. Hopefully it gets better. I'll see you for the next one.